Yo, what is up guys? So for today, I'm going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically, we're going to be looking at the armor from the Solstice events from previous seasons and to now. So if you want to see the new armor just right away, uh, the timestamp is right here. But I'm going to show you how the armor has evolved up until now. And honestly, it's pretty crazy. So obviously, this is the first one. This is the first one we ever had with the the ornament as well as you guys can see the the flash. I remember back in the day when I saw this, I was like, it's, it's okay. Like it looks a lot like the armor it was based off of obviously, but I think at the time it was okay. For the second armor, I think this one was the one where it was like, yo, this is good. Aside from, I don't know what the fuck is up with Bungie, but this up here, this changed in white to like blue down here is fucking weird. Don't know why they did that, but other than that, almost everything's cool i think the helmet's the weakest part and even then it's just because of that like really yellow gold thing like i think that color is just bad so if they change if they had changed that i would have been like dude this armor's fire even i still think this armor's fire <laughs> pun intended but i just really it pisses me off that we do not get this this ornament as an ornament it's only an ornament to this armor set unfortunately which ties into the new armor set somehow so let's look at the new armor which dude let me tell you right now shit looks fire like i think this is the best armor set right now for hunters it looks really good my only only gripe and i if you guys have been with me for a while you already know what it is this gold is unshaderable bro 2020 and we still have armor that you cannot fucking shader bungee please can you like like fix this so that it becomes silver dude you know how fire it you know how cool it is that this does not like this changes color the the trim let me show you guys real quick so you guys can understand what i'm talking about so this like brass gold looking thing in old in in the old ever or in the old solstice armor it wouldn't have changed color this one does look at this it looks so cool guys it looks so freaking cool i'm trying not to cuss as much but it looks so cool i just really wish that they changed this to silver like it's up here why not down here i don't understand this thought process and what's worse is it, it's on every class it's not just hunters titans have it on theirs Warlocks have it the worst in my opinion because the Warlocks have it on their chest piece not even on their class item which is on the Hunters and Titans. This is like I don't understand who works at Bungie. Why do you do this bro? Please talk to me. Why do you do this? Why do you have spots that you don't shader? Like is it Luke? Luke are you doing this? Like oh my executive call is you can't change that to any other color. Why are you doing this? Let me change it to silver my guy. Oh my god, like, what the fuck, dude? At this point, if a new armor set comes out and you can't change change color, a portion of it, you should already know, Tony's gonna be fucking mad. Because, well, look, look at this, this is a lot of real estate, my guy. This is a lot of real estate for this cloak. It's down up here to down here. You know what that means? I'm not using this, I'm not using that. Which means that, half of this or not even half a quarter of this ornament's useless to me because i'm not using that shit unless i'm rocking that that specific tint of gold which let me tell you in destiny 2 trying to find a specific color is literally like chopping mm, not even that like it's the most annoying thing in the game i tried to do it the other day i couldn't do it there's not a like mm, look at this so i tried a few colors here and there obviously i don't have them here but i tried like this one and i was like okay th that one's probably the closest but even then it's not that close it's like i can see like from afar it's like yeah that looks like the same color but then you notice it's like no no no, no. this is way lighter it looks almost copperish not copperish uh brass i think it's brass so yeah i would probably just be using something like this maybe with its corresponding yeah something like that but then it's like all oh, purple but with red so then i would have to change the, the my subclass to purple so i can match that it like 
This is this is what goes on to, in my head when I when I see shit like this. I would probably do this one to be quite honest. It looks so cool. Look at this. Look at this. I'd probably combine this chest piece with this uh, cloak, just because it looks so cool. It looks really cool. So it's just it's a really big annoyance I've, I have with Bungie the fact that like they have things that you just can't change color. Like this is a perfect example as well. Can't change color. Like that pisses me off a lot because I really like this cloak, but I can't change color. This one too, another one, why? Another one, why? Just so many things like why? And it's just, it gets even worse. Cause I'm just like, wow, we, we have a lot of them. And these are ones that I'm, I don't wear mostly because of that, why? Like, I don't understand why, like why we have this. So that's pretty much it. Aside from that, Dude, this armor is fucking wild. I love it. I absolutely adore this armor. And the ornament is really cool as well. Which brings me to my next point. All right, let me switch it to purple. So, I ended up getting the white for just completing the Pit of Heresy yesterday. And I'm kind of disappointed to be quite honest because it's connected to the armor. If it was somehow an ornament like, you know, the ornament, then I would have been, oh, that's cool. That means I can either have, you know, either A, this ornament, which is the Eververse ornament or the white ornament. But because it's the white ornament, that means it's connected to the armor specifically, which means I can't use it anywhere else aside from if I have that armor. And if I don't have a specific, you know, stat roll that i like on it then that means i'm fucked so essentially you know something like this no so let's go to my helmet so like this this stats uh, honestly are not that bad i probably wouldn't use it on the main build that i have mostly because this is what i have on that one it's mostly strength and then recovery then mobility so that one's immediately like i it's it's conflicting with what my build is or let's go with my boots my boots is another one it's like recovery is 20 strength 20 that sounds dope right well that one's my recovery and other stuff so not only that but it's my strides of the great hunt which i use for pve stuff uh i think one of the best news though is the fact that these packages right here do drop high stat rolls of this armor so if you do want some of this armor on like high stat rolls, you can do that. I actually have one that's like 67. Yeah, the chest piece is 67. That's just base bitch. That's not me putting anything. That's really good. So I I really like it. I really, really like this armor set. It's just obviously the gold trim. Just let us change it or just let it change to whatever color it is. I see no problem. Like. This armor set or this shader made all the trim silver. Fucking awesome. Would have loved to see that happen here because then I would have looked regal as fuck. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets, links are in the description below. Let me know what you guys think about the armor for the hunter. Obviously, the Titan and the Warlock are coming up next because I'm just completing the Titan right now. I'm honestly doing these videos, A, because I have to have a video today and because I needed a break because, oh my God, I've been grinding this nonstop since I got internet back, which funny enough, I lost my internet Tuesday reset, <laughs> literally like, what was it? Like 20 minutes in, I was like, okay, cool. I have a game plan. We had a thunderstorm and like lightning hit our tower apparently, which fried the modem. And I was like, cool. Didn't want to play anyways. So I started playing Minecraft. So yeah, that was fun. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, again, like I said, a uh, small percentage of people that actually view my videos are actually not subscribed. So if you can do me a favor and subscribe, I would very much appreciate it. Uh, be safe, guys. You know what's happening in the world. And other than that, we'll see you guys later.